What's up, Cowboy Nation? It's your boy, Cowboys Fan 0406, coming at you with another video. All right, I want to give a shout out to CWO, the Cowboys World Order. All right, I'm gonna jump in this video. I'm gonna do this video in one take. That's it. I don't give a shit if I mess up. Give a fuck. Doing this, I'm done. All right, so we're gonna talk about 313 Hitman. Cause he came out with another video. Asking about where the fuck I am. If I'm a, you know, fuck the Cowboys, bitch, and this and that. This dumbass. First of all. Don't make a video in the dark. Do not, because I couldn't even see your ass. All right, couldn't fucking see you. Secondly, I've never heard a man, and I emphasize on man, talk about how he's afraid of certain people. This motherfucker said, "I'm afraid of the offensive line. I'm afraid of Death Bryant. I'm afraid of Ezekiel Elliott." Get the fuck out of here, dude. Shut the fuck up. You sound stupid. You sound retarded when you speak, and you're. Duh, 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 and you're fucking low. Hey, man, hey, man. Man, shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up already, all right? And I'm done with you. I'm done with you. And I'm going to give you a reason why I'm done with you here in a bit. Let's move on to, uh, what's his name? Uh, Craig Jockman, right? That's your name? All right, first of all, I think you're an undercover Cowboy fan to begin with. You want to know why? Because your whole video that I saw, the 10 minutes that I had to fucking sit there and I'll fall asleep, because you sound so monotone. Oh, yeah, man. Uh, I think the uh, Jerry Jones should put in Jack Prescott. Blah, blah, blah. Man, this is why I think you're an undercover Cowboy fan. Because the whole video, or half the video, I should say, all you talked about was how Prescott's a beast, how Jerry Jones should put in Romo, and how Jerry Jones needs to keep playing Dak Prescott because Dak Prescott is the truth, and what this, and what that, and Zeke, and this, and that, and whatever else. Alright, that's why I'm saying you're an undercover oh cowboy God. fan. Because all you did was give props to my team. All you did, all, that's all you fucking did. That's all you fucking did was give props to my fucking team. And that's it. That's it. And I'm done with you on that. I'm done with both y'all. This is going to be my last video on both y'all. And one more, three, uh, one more thing, 3-1-3 three, uh, three hit, man. My defense is ranked number four or five overall. It's the top five defense. I know that for sure. I know we got the number one rushing defense in the fucking league. All right? It don't matter about my offensive line. That, that's why that my rushing defense is bad. Badass and yours is not. Yours is garbage. You don't got a fucking rushing defense. It has nothing to do with my offensive line. All right? Nothing. Nothing at all. You understand me? Get that through your head. Get that through all y'all's fucking fan base's head. That it has nothing to do with my offensive line. My defense is a beast on its own, all right? My defense is coming of age now. They are making a name for themselves. The no-name defense is what they are, and I love it. I love every fucking second of it, all right? So I'm fucking done with both y'all motherfuckers. And here's the reason why I'm done. You wanna know why? You wanna know why I'm done? Because last night, the motherfucking New York Giants lost to the Philadelphia Eagles, and the Cowboys became the number one seed. Cowboys became NFC East champs, all right? So when we play y'all Monday, I doubt, I doubt we're going to fucking shove our foot up your ass. I think we're going to let off the pedal a little bit, take it easy, get our reps in, treat it as a practice game because we have nothing to play for. We have nothing to play for. The best thing that could have happened to your Lions fucking team was the Eagles beating the, the Giants last night. The best thing. Because that lets that lets us ease off the gas. That that lets us take it easy, going into the playoffs, strolling in there like it's no big deal. And like I said, the NFC East, the NFC, my bad, the NFC has got to go through Jerry's world. All right, Jerry's world. And I doubt, I doubt that you Lions, when you if you make the playoffs, cause you got to beat us. And I still don't think that even if we let let off the gas pedal, that you're gonna be able to beat us. All right, Simon's brought uh, brought up uh, 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 brought something to my attention. I didn't realize Demarcus Lawrence was still hurt. I didn't realize that he was probably going to be done for the rest of the season. So now it's up to David Irving and Randy Gregory. That's why Randy Gregory is probably going to be playing because Demarcus Lawrence is hurt. So we're going to have Randy Gregory coming off one side and David Irving coming off the other, and he better play more because David Irving's a beast. He is a game changer on defense. All right, we've been looking for a pass rush. We found it in David Irving. We found it. We found it right there. All right? We found one. I cannot wait for Monday. 
Win or lose, it makes no difference. You know what? If we lose, I'll come on here and do my pro like I'm supposed to. If we win, but I want... If we fucking win, I want a... I want a fucking bomb-ass pro because if we beat y'all, it's not because we fucking shoved our foot down your ass. I mean, up your ass and fucking kicked your ass. No. It's because your team fucking sucks. And even on our lazy days, we can still beat your ass. Alright? So, I'm done with this. This is my last video on y'all fucking two. Probably gonna come out one more later on today about the Cowboys and the NFC East and the, and the playoffs and what's gonna happen. So, right now, 313 and Jock uh, and uh, uh, Craig Jockman, I'm done with y'all. I'm done. It's over. I'll see you Monday. Alright? I'll see you Monday after the game. I'm done. Cowboy Nation, I'm out. Shout out to CWO. Peace!